Watch out, little kitty. Kitty, goodbye. Oh, no, no, no. This could be dangerous. Bye. Well, let me explain. Hey, friends. So, in today's episode, let us learn a few survival tricks and tactics on how to survive a dog attack. Zoom in. Dogs. These lovely animals are our best friends and guardians of our houses. But at times, due to fear, anxiety or conflict, they can get very aggressive and snarl or even bark at us. And due to our fight or flight response, if we start running, then the dog's wolf side can get triggered and they might think of us as their prey. Then there is a high chance they might chase us down or even attack us. Of course, it's not a dog's fault as they are just acting according to their ancestral traits. But for our safety, let us learn what we can do to tackle such a challenging situation and survive a dog attack. Well, in that case, the first thing to keep in mind is not to panic. Yes, as we know, dogs can sense our fear. So if you come face to face with an aggressive dog ready to attack, try not to make any movement and remain as calm as possible. And if you're already running and the dog is threatened by the speed of your movement, then slow down to a walk and eventually stand still. Also, avoid making direct eye contact with the dog as it will take it as a challenge. So, just make sure you stand a little aside with your hands by your side like a tree while keeping the dog in your peripheral vision. In many cases, the dog will lose interest and walk away if you ignore him. But if the dog stays, try and distract the dog with another object. Yes, if you are carrying a water bottle, jacket or something, throw it in the other direction. This may distract the dog and give you enough time to escape slowly. And if nothing seems to work, then the best possible solution could be to act dominating. Make eye contact and command the dog to back off in a firm and very confident voice. By doing this, the dog may find you intimidating and run away. But the vital question is, what if things turn for the worse and the stubborn dog starts biting you? Well, in that case, the last resort is to fight back. I know it sounds unfortunate, but you got to defend yourself as your life depends on it. So, if the dog grabs you by the teeth, use your feet or make a fist and try smacking a blow on the nose, throat or back of the head and scream for help while doing so. And the most important thing to do while fighting is to protect your vital parts like your face, eyes and throat as that can be very dangerous. So to protect it, try using your weight to your advantage by pressing the back of the dog with your partial body weight and applying forward pressure to the back of the neck to immobilize the dog until help comes. And once you get help, quickly rush to the hospital to take care of the wounds. And if needed, take an anti-rabies shot. Why? Well, to know more, check out our video, What Causes Rabies Afterwards. Trivia time! Did you know, US alone reports around 4.5 million dog bites a year? Yes! So, the best way to reduce dog attacks is by training them, having them in a protected yard or keeping them on a leash if people are around. Hope you learned something vital today. 
Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Oh, never mind. <laughs>